What's up everybody? I hope you're having a good day today. Today, uh, we are starting by doing two board fulfillments. We had the request come in late yesterday afternoon, so today we gotta get them boxed up and in the mail. I think we actually got a couple of addresses from homeowners too, so that'll be nice to put them on our mailing list, so. Bruce, are you excited? Yeah? Yesterday, Jenny flew through Tropical Storm Peter again. Looks like it's supposed to fizzle out before it even hits Bermuda, so that's good news. Hope everybody there stays safe. If you live there, listen to the National Weather Service. They're really picky. They don't like us saying the for you check for updates. Don't listen to me. I'm not official. She did that, and then, oh, speaking of which, we're gonna wrap this up pretty soon, so our annual hurricane fundraiser, you buy this shirt, we donate some money to help with hurricane re disaster relief, so um, links in the description. You can go find that. I uh, get the 2021 shirt before it's too late. All right, these boxes are in the, I was gonna say they're in the mail. They're not in the mail, they're in the box ready to go. So I get to go to the UPS store, drop those off, and then I have a little adventure planned for us. The vacuum was not the adventure. I just wanted to make a clean transition to the next segment. We're Jenny and Davis. We fly through hurricanes for research and build furniture for fun. A while ago, we came up with a business plan to sell quality furniture, which brings people together. Follow along as we build our business empire. Empire? Yes, Jenny, big goals. Okay, we're starting an empire. Maybe one day it'll span beyond the garage. Man, this is crazy. This is like Christmas in the 90s now. Halloween's nuts. Am I doing this right? Well, as much fun as this is, I'm actually here for a new table saw blade. So um, you guys were suggesting a low tooth count rip blade. So I'm gonna find one. I know these aren't the highest quality, but if, if it makes as big a difference as y'all say it does, then I'll be able to tell the cheap one first. Then I can buy a nicer blade. So honestly, I wasn't planning on doing this test again for another couple of weeks. Um, I just thought that I was gonna finish this batch with the bandsaw like I always do and 
from there, we were just gonna test this blade at a later date. But y'all were so fast. I figured that was easy enough. I didn't have to like consciously, like it's it's just a blade swap. I thought the fix was gonna have to be like, change how I'm using the table saw or readjust something for several hours. But a lot of your suggestions were good. A lot of them I addressed, or maybe I wasn't clear enough in the video, but a lot of the things you suggested other than the blade, I have addressed and tried to fix on my own. So we're gonna throw the blade in. We're gonna finish this test. So I guess, to the shop. this part because I'm always afraid I'm gonna drop the nut down into the dust collection pipe. I've never done it yet, but today will be the day. In the commercial space, we're gonna have like three table saws. We're gonna have one set up with a combination blade. We're gonna have one set up with a rip blade. We're gonna have one set up with a dado stack, maybe a couple with different dado stacks. I hate changing blades. It just, it takes way too long. You know, the time that you spend changing the blade in an entire year, if you value your labor at $30 an hour, it probably works out close to paying for another table saw, you know, over a one or two year period. So poor people save money. Rich people buy assets. If a tool is going to save you time, you need to buy it. End rant. All right, well, initial results. You guys were right on the money. We went from this yesterday to this today. It's a lot smoother. Um, I will say it's not perfect. I'm still having to add additional pressure to move it through because it's still binding on the riving knife. Yeah, I mean, that it definitely helped. Thank you for your suggestions. If you were one of the hundreds of people that commented and, and gave that suggestion, I really appreciate it. So this is great news. That means we can continue with the test today. So. I'm gonna make a little change to the test though. Um, yesterday I started with like an equal amount of material and I was gonna see how fast I could process all that material. I think I'm going to do something different with this test. I think I'm gonna set a predetermined amount of time and try to do as many as responsibly feasible in the given amount of time. No, we're not. We're not doing any of that. I just got a request for two more boards to fulfill, so not today. We were this close. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. Subscribe, like, all do the things, and uh, check out these t-shirts. Go check out the hurricane video if you want to see it. Uh, yeah, have fun.